Like artificial intelligence, robotics, and the Internet of Things, the buzz around 3D printing has grown louder and louder in recent years. As a key component of Industry 4.0, 3D printing allows for new digital production methods and could revolutionize supply chains. That's because instead of using cutting, milling, and grinding, methods that have been around for over a century, 3D printing uses a deceptively simple process of building up parts through the layering of plastic or metal. In industries such as automotive, industrial machines, healthcare, and aerospace, 3D printing could simplify the repair of complex and costly parts, or could produce customized parts easily for the automotive aftermarket and make medical implants. And awareness of 3D printing is high. In a recent PwC strategy and survey, over 37% of respondents said that they would use 3D printing in their digital factories over the next five years. That was ahead of robots, AI, or drones. Yet, in spite of this awareness of the technology and its potential benefits, there remain many questions around 3D printing and significant uncertainty around when to apply it. Do you replace an existing part with a 3D printed replica? Or do you think of a new solution, redesign your processes and the part completely, and 3D print that? And when is it cost effective to 3D print something, and when is it not? So with all these important questions to consider, where do companies get strategic insight into 3D printing? And whether to implement it in their business? Strategy and, in conjunction with 3D printing specialist Materialize, has developed a proprietary market model to help understand where the market is going. It shows that 3D printing will grow very quickly in the next few years, most likely around 20% compound annual growth rate over the next decade. And it examines the key drivers propelling the industry forward, ranging from the pace at which new types of materials will be certified by regulators to the speed at which algorithms will be used to help automate designs. It also shows how the overall development of 3D printing will be driven not only by progress in the underlying technologies, but also by the rate of integration into existing business models. And the cost simulator provides a detailed cost analysis part by part, allowing companies to see for the first time whether 3D printing makes commercial sense for their activities. These new models and tools provide companies with a valuable and unique perspective into the tremendous opportunities that lie within the 3D printing revolution and a better understanding of how to harness them. These insights enable the right strategic decisions, allowing companies to master 3D printing for the next decade and beyond. Strategy and create strategy that works.